Hi everybody, I'm Philip Duncan and thanks for joining us for our special weather video this weekend because we've got two anniversary weekends, Auckland and Nelson. So a big chunk of the country has Monday off. We're going to cover that as well. Plus the heat wave going on in Australia that might affect New Zealand on the Monday. So let's have a look and see what's happening at the moment. For Friday, uh, here's the animated wind map, high pressure in charge and warmer winds are about to come in after that cooler southerly change we had on Thursday. That is disappearing and we're about to get hot. Hot weather in Australia too, feeding straight down towards Melbourne and that's where we start our weather video today in Australia. Look at these temperatures. Friday afternoon, 43 degrees forecast for Melbourne, 46 degrees further inland, 44, 40 uh, and 38 so over around the eastern side, even 36 down in Hobart, Tasmania. So this is some very hot weather for Australia for Friday. Now some of that hot weather, this is that here in the northwest flow, you see that sort of red line that's it's being pulled out of Australia, that warm, that warmth coming out. So the temperatures in New Zealand do lift up on Saturday as a result of that nor'wester. There's a little bit of rain though that will kind of counteract the warmth with the cloud cover down here around Fiordland and maybe coming in a little bit around Southland and Otago as well. Elsewhere mostly dry but there might be a lingering shower just in the north around all that high pressure. On Sunday things warm up even further. Those are the hot winds coming down and across the central part of the country. Places like Nelson in Marlborough warming up around 30 degrees, late 20s over on the eastern side and late 20s or early 30s for the eastern side of the North Island but the western side a little cloudier, a little bit cooler, your highs around the uh, mid 20s and around Wellington it might be a little bit cloudy at times under this setup. Now to Monday and obviously half the country has that day off. We've got this hot weather over here in that red circle, those places will be in the low 30s but what it doesn't show you is Nelson's potential to get to 33 degrees on Monday as that Australian heat finally reaches our shores properly. So 33 degrees is possible in Nelson uh, on Monday but there is a cooler change coming up the South Island here as well which will kind of counteract it. And then we get to Tuesday, high pressure is firmly in charge around both islands. Uh, still a bit of rain down around Fiordland and maybe up to South Westland but it looks like Hokitika, Greymouth and Westport all look dry as does Queenstown and Invercargill. So those southern areas are, are seeing some improvements and in fact next week looks mostly dry for people who are wanting to cut hay and things like that and for those who need the rain we may not be seeing a big rainmaker. The tropics are very dry to our north. They're active off to the northwest, they're pretty active off to the northeast but directly north of us not a lot happening. Maybe later into the first week of February there might be something in the north worth keeping an eye on but for now there's another high coming in south of Aussie directly towards us while there is a bit of rain happening around the southwestern corner of the South Island in particular, most places are drier than average for the next week or so ahead. That is all from me. Have a great weekend, whether it's a short one or a normal one or a long one. Have a great one. I'm not back until Tuesday though. This is uh, not often that I say this, but I'm very grateful to be an Aucklander because I get Monday off. So I will see you all on Tuesday. <laughs>